David Beckham still has to be content with a place on the substitutes bench, although he is still carrying a slight back injury. Uh, out go Philip Neville, who drops to the bench. So too does Dwight York. Picked up by Varane, and now Scholes. Yeah, I think one of the things that's been lacking in United is the competitive spirit, Steve. I think probably that's with a lack of confidence sometimes when you're not winning games. So let's hope we can get that today. This is Gary Neville. A weird double jersey that there. It's a bit girlish looking, but when you're used to hot weather, it's not. Perron has found Gary Neville. Plenty waiting for the cross. Perron once more. Keane has come wide on this occasion to try and find Butt. Made away by Riggett. Only as far as Sabre Varane. Just lost his footing. That's a goal kick to Derby. Yeah, a little bit unforced. Old Trafford has the volume raised once more. Well, a big lift for the team, Steve. Big lift for everybody in the ground. The way things have been going of late. Now is Verón going to go for goal here? He's trying to pick out Keane instead. As far as Butt, Scholes with a good leap. Scorer here last season, of course, to keep Derby in the Premiership. Away by O'Shea, and then by Silvestre. This is much better from Manchester United. They're on to Solskjaer. The Argentinian again. He will have come up against Fabrizio Ravanelli, of course, plenty of times. And as far as United are concerned, and Roy Keane, who'd gone eight months in the Premiership without a goal. The last time he scored was in the 6-1 demolition of Arsenal here. And I'll tell you what, the start they've made. Very competitive, Steve. I think that's the important thing about tonight. Very... Yeah, young rugged there, good little player. He'll not be happy with him. It's the way things have started for Derby tonight. Normal service has been resumed. Nisteroy got a touch, Skulls on the volley. Couldn't quite keep it down. Yeah, just an awkward little bounce for Paul. Really get behind it, and the direction's not great, and over the bar. Had that league goal at last night, it's his 12th league start tonight. Here he is again, trying to find Butt, whose last goal in the Premiership came against Derby. Here he is again. Silvestre. Brian Partez. Looking for his third clean sheet of the season in the Premiership. Higginbron got a nasty blow to the head there, unintentionally from Ruud van Nistelrooy. Yes, he did, it was unintentionally, but you're after... Quarter of an hour at Old Trafford. Verón. Nisteroy leaves it for Keane. And he's found Sylvester. Keane in with a strong challenge. Now there's three square of skulls. Sylvester's given him an option outside of him too. This is fine. Well played, John. The manager was saying to me before the game that it was a different kind of test for him tonight. He clearly done enough against West Ham to make the manager stick with him. There's always an option to play Gary Neville in the centre and Phil Neville at full-back. It's a big boost to John O'Shea to be given another well, chance. Well, he played very well on Saturday. He was one of the fellas on Saturday you could... Now Keane. <laughs> Rob Nelly was a little casual there. This is Gary Neville. Might be another opportunity for Ferron to get this one into the penalty area. Always tried the extremely cheeky, and it was just too strong for Gary Neville. Well, it was a wonderful ball, wasn't it? Great imagination, this fella. You did foul him, Gary. You can't get away with it, son. Does well down the Higginbottom again here and get the ball. That's it gives you. It really has settled United down, as we thought it might. That's for Ron looking for skulls. Very, oh, very nearly found him. Very nearly got an opportunity. Second time round, Francois. Andy Oaks is organising his wall. Four so far this season. Veron got through the wall. 
and Oakes gathered at the first attempt. That was too crook dispossessed. This is for on now. Oh, he was trying to slide it through to Van Nistelrooy, and then he was trying to find skulls. The manager was saying to me the other day, Paddy, the one thing about him, he'll never try and play a negative ball. Everything's in front of him. No question about that. And a very adventurous player, isn't it? And there's a type of player that Manchester United fans love to watch. They love exciting players. Here he is again. It's a key. Halfway point in the first half. Just a sort of pattern of play. And goals that Alec Ferguson and everyone correct with United would have wished and hoped for. Veron. Skulls did well. Here he is again, up against Mawini. He's trying to find Solskjaer. Just for his position, Blanc is up. O'Shea is up there as well. It's towards the back post, and that was Skulls. And really, he will know from that way out, he should have made that 3 0. I think he's had it with his shoulder, Steve. I don't think he's had it at all, Paul. He'll be very disappointed there when his ball comes, and he knows he should have scored, no question about that. I think it's his chest, shoulder, he doesn't get his head to it and just can't keep it down. He'll be very disappointed there, Paul. Just will not... Skulls. To Solskjaer. And Van Nistelrooy. And this is much, much more like Manchester United. That isn't. Bartes had to be alert and was alert. And it's cheeky too. <laughs> uh, that was tremendous better play by the goalkeeper, wasn't it? And Old Trafford faithful enjoyed that. Ferran. He's been just about everywhere and he's won the corner. Well, he's cost a total of 62 million in transfer fees throughout his career so far. On nights like tonight, you can certainly see why. Doesn't phase him, does it? Yeah, he's got great ability, no question about that. It's not a bad ball either. Keane was up. It's a Solskjaer. Looking for a little bit of help, but was patient to find skulls. Now he's put going to strike one. Quick feet from Solskjaer. Derby just can't get near the ball at the moment. We're on. We're on. Skulls. Gary Neville. O'Shea with the foot in. Laurent Blanc high up the field. Skulls has Veron in support. The passing's really so much better, Steve. And as, as I say, the more competitiveness in there, Steve, a lot better pass. The passing's excellent, that's the thing that's most important. Sylvester, who's already made a couple of telling runs down that left-hand side. At Laurent Blanc. I mean, he plays the ball, Zebi Veron, and he, he can't get it back quick enough, can he? Gets it back there from Keane. Ah, but that shows you when players are enjoying themselves, Steve, and they want the ball all the time.
on Mace Roy. Perron has picked out Gary Neville with such ease. Gary Neville was trying to pick out one of those red shirts in the penalty area. Yeah, good bit of football from United. A nice self-belief had to be retained tonight. And so far, so good. The passing between the four midfield players has been intriguing. None of them have really stayed in a set position. And they've really made Dart beat work hard to get any kind of ball back. Here they come again, looking for Solskjaer. And Danny Higginbottom, the former United. The passing between the four midfield players has been intriguing. And none of them have really stayed in a set position. And they've really made Dart beat work hard to get any kind of ball back. Here they come again, looking for Solskjaer. And Danny Higginbottom, the former United player, was across with a very good challenge. Had to be as well, Steve, it was a great challenge. I think Oliver would have made it foot three there. Veron. <laughs> Just won too many on that occasion from Sabre Veron. But the four midfield players... <laughs> well, they're all the good passers, Steve. And the they're movement all good as well. The ball, they move off the ball well. I mean, this is a wonderful bit of football there, the little ball by Paul Scholes, aren't you? Fan Steve, you're talking about loving United players, maybe more than that at all. A bit hot by the way the results have gone at the moment. I know you want to rectify that as soon as possible. Don't like getting beaten when you're a player. And they've never been beaten. It's clearly evident that that's coming back by the minute out there at the moment. Skulls, he wants a goal. He was disguising the shot to try and pick out Gary Neville. Clearly evident that that's coming back by the minute out there at the moment. Skulls, he wants a goal. He was disguising the shot to try and pick out Gary Neville. It's three on two in United's favour. And well done, John O'Shea. Yeah, well done, son. I thought tonight would have been a hard task for him, but he's come through it so well at the moment. Leicester again, in towards Solskjaer. Keane drills it across, and Higginbottom, not for the first time, gets it clear. Veron, he was trying the spectacular as always. Still not clear, though. Van Nistelrooy. Lovely play. Plenty waiting for the cross. He can go in on that occasion. Well, this is much, much, much better. But... The run popping up on the left-hand side. Got the angle for the shot, or the cross. Now when he's header away. Wicked ball goes in if it was... Laurent Blanc has done well to find Veron. Passing again, you only have to admire. Laurent Blanc has done well to find Veron. Passing again, you only have to admire. Oh, fantastic, McKee. Absolutely fantastic. large parts of this Premiership season so far, United have not been the team recognised by everyone for large parts of it tonight. They look like the United of old. And this is now Van Nistelrooy. And Derby are throwing men in desperation in front of the ball. That was Rigget with the block that time. And Butler's won the corner. But there isn't going to be time for it. That is the half-time whistle. And 45 minutes that this time sees the fact.
his four midfielders play. There he is again with a cross. It skulls with a volley. And it was the outstretched leg of Andy Oakes that denied the United midfielder. Yeah, great strike by Paul. That's a lovely touch from Scholes. He might get it back, that's where it was intended. He still might have a go. Yeah, I think he's... Good ball, it's a great strike by Paul Scholes. The way he keeps it down. Got to give the goalkeeper credit. Scholes. Gith win. Of the derby over the years. Scholes. For Ron. Gary Neville, who, like Sylvester, is being asked to do an awful lot of running up and down that right flank tonight. He's given it back to Verrott. United's play rather squeezed in the central area at the moment. Verrott trying to open it up. And that keep driving forward for midfield. Cut out by Riggett. Goals. He'd love a goal. Veron has picked out Butt. He hasn't scored for 13 months. It's Nicky Butt to Van Nistelrooy, and Oakes denies them again. Good save by the goalkeeper. Nicky had two options. Him or Paul Scholes. I mean, I think Paul Scholes might have been a better. It's a great ball straight to Nicky, but he gets in behind the defender. He's got rude there, but if you just see Paul Scholes in the 18-yard line. Nobody near him. Screaming it to Scholes. Van Nistelrooy has made the run. It's Van Nistelrooy. Tight angle. Solskjaer! With a little ball in from Paul. I mean, the angle here is incredible. And how he gets the strike at goal. The goal it does... Too much in charge of Derby tonight since taking over from Jim Smith. Not a particularly happy one for him. Van Nistelrooy. Well, a defenders and goalkeepers love to see a clean sheet. They don't care how many scored at the other end as long as they don't let any in. Skulls. Sylvester is on his bike again. This time Skulls has checked. Aim towards Gary Neville. But did the mopping up. Key. Well, he wanted it back, Keane, he got it back, Van Nistelrooy! Well, he's got it. You never know, they might be more off it, but that's a great ball in from Roy Keane. Burton's ball in again. Skulls back there with a the header. Now Laurent Blanc, it's a night for it for defenders. Nicky Butt. Ron was looking for Nisteroy. It comes to Skulls though. Just wanted it to open up for him. Now but and Skulls once more. United who astonishingly haven't scored in their last two games. I did beauty of the Parsons made it very difficult for Derby. They've been chasing shadows nearly all night. Chasing them now too with scores. Just and they played with each other on over 40 occasions for the French national side. Communication that watches the remaining 17 minutes from the bench. Scholes thought he was going to hit one. The crossing opportunity for Gary Neville. Keen. Oh, Van Nistelrooy might have another chance. He's trying to repay the favour to Scholes. They were trying to walk it in. Is he trying to give Paul Scholes a goal? I think at this situation he should hit it, he should draw his foot back and just belt it. He plays it, but he just touches that wee bit too hard and the angle's too much for Paul. Gets it back across the ball, the goal, but Rudge just... They're on. Gary Neville, who's been like a right winger at times tonight. Van Nistelrooy. 
Put it back from Higginbottom. Again gets the block in. Only as far as Veron. All the tricks from Sabre Veron. Is there a finish? Oh, just over Van Nistelrooy's head. Keane. Another goal would be nice as well, Steve, just to finish the night off. Veron has found Gary Neville. It's Veron once more. Oh, he was just trying to find Dwight York. Outstanding. Skulls. Brilliantly away from Carbona. That's the Paul Skulls of old. And that's... A big Philip to see it. Oh, players, you'd never think players can lose confidence. Very easy. Veron looking for butt. That was a magnificent bit of vision again by Sabre Veron. Almost came off. Veron. <laughs> In towards Solskjaer. Well, lad. Scholes is looking for York, is there a goal in it for him tonight? It's Dwight York, wouldn't quite sit up for him. Solskjaer, is he going to set one up for Scholes? He'll try, it's Paul Scholes, and he has got his goal! Five for the night, his first... Of I mean, Oli Solskjaer does tremendously well there, you think Oli can shoot, shoot, he's on his hat-trick, no. Play it through, he does well, Paul drives it to, drags it to the right. Nice little ball in from Oli. He's going to shoot, but just a little dummy. Just pull it to the right. Thank you very much. Well done, Paul. And the passing that's been there throughout the 90 minutes is still there. And this man has been at the centre of most of it. Sabre Veron. But of course, we'll want his son to be on the winning side. That, in truth, was never, ever a possibility tonight. Right from the off. It has uh, looked more like the champions of last season against the team who survived on the final day of last season. Solskjaer. And never satisfied. All the space here for Scholes. And he's found Sabre Veron. There's three waiting for the cross. Might go it alone, Veron. One trick too many. 